can't pre-treat the roads because the rain that is falling now will wash away the chemicals before the sleet and the snow get here. But with blizzard warnings in effect, the state patrol is urging caution over the next 48 hours. Our Reg Chapman now is live in Monticello where the rain and the hail have been coming down there, Reg. Well, photojournalist Joe Berglove and I have been riding this weather roller coaster all day long. First, we noticed that the temperatures began to drop, and then all of a sudden, the wind began to pick up. And then, from the sky, what I call Minnesota cotton, those big flakes of snow began falling. And seeing all that made people believe that this April snowstorm could be only hours away. Truck drivers were the first to notice the rapid change in the weather. Rigs were lining up outside a truck stop in St. Cloud. They were looking for refuge from the wind that made it hard for them to control their trucks on the road. They were right to pull over. Minutes after they parked, the sky opened up and a mixture of snow and ice began to fall. Driving on I-94 near Monticello was slick in some spots and sloppy in others. I don't know, my birthday is in two days and I never had snow on my birthday, so. Dan Kissling made his way to a convenience store to get snacks and water. He says driving in this will only get worse as the evening turns to night. Just wind and it's getting more slushy and it's going to be more slippery. Now the wind is still the big problem here in Monticello, but it's not stopping people from getting out and going to the stores to get what they need for the next couple of hours when they believe the big snowstorm will hit. Some people are even lining up here outside the Poncho Villa Mexican restaurant here in Monticello. They have two for one margaritas, guys, and they tell me one lady I spoke with say that it was going to be cold and snowy outside. This is going to be sitting inside the Poncho Villa with her margarita thinking warm and sunny thoughts. All right, some smart folks in Monticello. Thank Thank you, Reg. The forecasted snow, ice, and wind are the perfect recipe for power outages. XL Energy has more than 250 workers prepped and ready to respond to calls throughout the weekend. Safety, of course, always a concern, and we're told getting to the site of the outage may be the trickiest part. It's the, the driving and walking and just getting to the outage restoration. Uh, these uh, electrical workers have uh, fantastic skills working with electric. It's really getting to the job and working around those logistics uh, that would, we're most worried about. Several airlines have issued travel advisories this weekend at MSP, and MnDOT postponed some construction projects in the metro because of all the snow in the forecast. And to stay on top of the spring storms, remember you can download the free WCCO weather app. It includes live radar and storm alerts.